most important tools that you can have when you're out here on the flats fishing for these permanent and bone fish are good polarized sunglasses like these Salt Life Optics that I have. They have Zeiss lenses and they really help cut through this water. And uh, as you can see, looking through this water here, everything looks the same. The bone fish, the permit, everything blends in with it. And these glasses can kind of just bring that fish out to help it pop a little bit. And we've just dropped from about a foot of water to about probably five or six feet here. We're uh, kind of cruising across this deeper flat looking for some bigger permit. And uh, these optics are gonna be the thing that's gonna help us catch this fish. Because if I can't see it, I can't put my bait on it to catch it. So we're just gonna keep pushing across here and see if we can pick anything up here moving through this grass flat. There you go, you got him. All right. <laughs> Good job, bro. Beautiful, beautiful. What a fish, Jeff. Yeah. Beautiful permit. My oh. first permit, Jimmy. That is awesome. First one of the night. Be here and experience that. That sounds you. great, man. And right here in your backyard, right in my backyard. That is awesome. Wow, what a gorgeous fish, man. We got this fish on a Tsunami 3000 shield. Um, they just came out and. Uh, you know, this, Jeff has a house here on Roatan. He's been wanting to catch a permit, caught plenty of bonefish. Came out here with Captain Raoul, and it didn't take long at all. Didn't take long at all. All right, well, there's that permit. We got him revived. He's good to go. Put up a great fight for Jeff, and I'm not going to prolong this anymore. We're going to get out there and catch another one because there's all kinds of fish tailing right up here. The wind's picking up. We want to get some before this wind really starts kicking up. Look at that fish, man. What a beautiful fish. There he goes. There's a fish here. Get him. Good job. Woo! Nice. Well done, Louisa. Good, go. Woo good fish. Nice well fish. done. Oh, perfect cast, perfect everything. All you have to do is give it a try. Yeah. It's a it is a bonefish, guys. Bone. Good job. Nice fish. He's right here. Yep. Well, it's going to take a minute to bring him in. It's OK. I got all day. All right, he's ready, Louisa. All right, he's ready. Got it? I think so. All right. Nice fish. Nice. Oh, look at that J hook right there in the corner of his mouth. Got a little weight on this hook, a little different than the other one. The reason we did that is it just helps it cast a little farther with these light shrimp. And the only shrimp you can get here on the island, like he was hooked perfect, are uh, frozen shrimp. <laughs> what do you think of that? Very nice, I wanna catch a lot more. <laughs> now she saw that fish all on her own, pointed it out, made the cast. We weren't even sure if it was a bone fish, and sure enough it was. I'm just gonna hand it to you and let you land, uh, sorry, release your fish, okay? All right, guys, so I'm about to release this really nice uh, bonefish here in beautiful Roatan, Honduras. There's tons more here in the flats, and I'm ready to catch another one. He's about ready to, about ready to go. Here he goes. All right. Woo! I do have them, trust me. Uh, yeah, that's what I'm telling you. <laughs> He's on there. I felt him pick him up, that's what I was saying. What I got this fish on is the new Tsunami 3000 Shield, and I'm spooled up with 15 pound Dominate Tough Line Braid down to a 20 pound Yozuri Top Knot Fluorocarbon Leader. And the reason we're using 20 pound leader again is because these fish can cut us off very easily if we can't stop them. The shield rod is dynamite for fishing the flats. Amazing flex in the rod, super soft tip. I love it, you can feel everything that's happening. I think it's gonna be a lot easier to pick this fish up here this way. 
Look at that thing. Goodness. This is what it's all about, guys. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and grab this fish if you wanna lead him towards me here. Really easy with him. We got him. There he is. Look at that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> hey, buddy. All right, man. Yeah. Woo, we got him. And that's a good fish. Look at that. Circle hook right in the side of the mouth. What a gorgeous fish, bro. Wow, you did it again. Oh, man. Well, this is, in my opinion, the ultimate fish to catch on the flats like this. I prefer, prefer this over a tarpon or a bonefish or anything else. This is just a powerhouse fish right here, man. And they are phenomenal to eat, but we always let the permit go because we want to catch more of them. It's easy to come out here and pick them off and uh, you know lower the population very quick, and we don't want to do that. We want to keep them alive. Look at that. Well, man, no time at all, and he is gone.